Here's how you look good during your winter golf rounds. Hey, what's up, guys? I'm Jeremy. And I'm Riley. And we are the Golf Style Guys. And today we're going to be taking you through how to dress during those golf winter rounds out there so to stay warm and make sure you're still looking good because we're all about looking good out there. But in the winter, we have to stay warm. So, Riley, what's your take while playing golf in the cold? We'll say sub 40. Layers, man. Everybody knows that playing really good golf is tough to do in a bunch of layers. Uh, the la obviously flexibility goes away, all that kind of stuff goes away. Um, big into the like the thin Under Armour kind of bottom layer on top and bottom, okay. and then I'm a I'm a big hoodie guy most of the season, and that just kind of comes out a lot in the winter. I usually don't wear anything but a hoodie on the top for sure because warmth is everything especially if you're walking during a winter round you need something to keep you warm the entire time right. and then i'm a big i'm a big winter hat guy on the golf course i'm gonna wear a winter hat for sure Coupling. um as soon as it hits under 50 40 degrees somewhere in that area it's not gonna be it's not gonna be a uh, normal baseball hat anymore it's gonna be a winter hat for right. sure right. and then d when it gets windy during the winter the neck gaiters that you put down that people are using for masks these days. I put them on my neck. Exactly. Some people aren't a huge fan of the look. Uh, I'm not, I don't know, visually I'm a big fan of the look, yeah. but they're definitely very practical. For sure. Um, so those are kind of my keys during winter rounds. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm gonna have to go a little bit of the opposite. I feel more the more layers I have on, the, the worse I play. So I, I, the less layers for me, the better. I don't care what the weather is. I, I, I'm at most, I'm going out with one underlayer. So maybe maybe one long sleeve. If it's if it's sub 40, I'll go with one long sleeve. Anything above 40, I'll go with nothing. Just a short sleeve under underneath. Maybe a vest on top. Uh, nothing again. You know we love hoodies here, so I'll, uh, no problem with rocking a hoodie on. Definitely the uh, Scully beanie, whatever you want to call it. Big fan of those on the golf course, especially in the winter. I'm right on with you with the, with the neck gaiter. Even a jacket vest, light, very lightweight jacket vest. I love throwing on three quarter zips. That's like something like this. Um, that's all where I like to stay in the winter. Of course, it's all about staying warm, but you still want to play well. Even though we say to ourselves, "All right, I'm not going to score today. It's a winter round. You know, conditions aren't great." Still, I want to be able to swing and, and, and move because at the end of the day, it is bonus golf. So, whatever I'm trying to do is to, to, to play my best out there. For sure, and I'm a big best guy, also. I uh, love rocking a vest and I think a little bit underrated winter gear that guys and girls can wear is uh, the rain gear, the rain jacket, rain pants. Sure. Um, they're very insulated. They're very warm for the yeah. most part. And it can't, the conditions in the winter obviously aren't great. The course is in great condition. You never know when you're going to get a little drizzle during the winter. So the rain gear is definitely a thing that I wear every once in a while yeah. during my winter rounds. Um, but yeah, just staying warm. I could never do what you do. One yeah. layer on the bottom underneath. Yeah, I Hell no. I don't, I no, no, I, no. I think that comes from like playing baseball or something like that. Cause I just don't feel it, dude. I mean, I feel it, but like it doesn't phase me. Right. And I played indoor sports. I played basketball, so I guess I don't get it. <laughs> um, but yeah, I could never, ever, ever do that. That is cold. I need to stay warm, yeah. especially I walk most of the time. I don't usually take a cart. So if I had one layer underneath a hoodie and I walked 18 holes, I would not survive 18 holes. That's a, uh, that's another great tip to stay warm. Just walk during the winter. Don't even take a cart because you'll be killing yourself and you'll be you'll find yourself with a jacket on, with a down parka in the car. That's how cold it is. I always walk no matter from, from, from November to March I'm walking. Definitely key to staying warm are these hand warmers. Uh, I think it was Ronnie from New Jersey who said, if you put this in your pocket, you got to put your ball in the same pocket as your hand warmer keeps the ball warm and it just let the ball fly i like that i don't know if i've heard that before no oh, yeah, def right. definitely use it for your hands because you need putting another key thing that, that can help and something i use are the winter soft foot joy winter soft gloves you keep those on they're nice and tight you got some gloves out here that are so big so massive what do you think of the huge the huge winter the mitts? like foot joy gloves the mitts no, what do you think about the mitts not a, mm, not a fan because I like the practical on, use. I like the practical use. Yeah, I mean, I they're I, super warm. I understand that, but you're if you think about it, you have them off more times than you have them on. Hundred percent. Yeah. Because, I mean, I'm not swinging a golf club with those things. Right. On. You can't. But yeah. practically, they keep them warm, so I kind of get it. Uh, but yeah, just the normal winter soft, the weather soft gloves are, are money for sure. You see that picture of Jason Day? I'll throw it up on here in a second. But you see that picture of Jason Day? I think it's at the U.S. Open. Um, I'm sorry, the British Open. And he's walking down the fairway with, like, mitts on. 
Yeah. I think they that's like a big tour thing because obviously I mean the caddy can carry whatever they're gonna wear um but yeah I think Rory had him going on during the open is obviously where you see all the winter gear come out because that tournament is awful (laughs) weather-wise um but yeah I think that's the big winter foot joys or whatever brand are huge on tour when it gets below I mean those guys are used to Florida weather so when it gets below 60 you see guys wear some stuff on tour um but yeah i don't know if i could use those no let's kick it over to social media real quick this comes from sean doyle uh i think everything is fair game as long as it's golf related apparel but no sweatpants what's your take on that yeah i mean i'm not a huge sweatpants guy i've put i've put like a thin sweatpant underneath like my golf pants to stay warm i don't know if i'm a huge like that's your bottom (laughs) <laughs> during a round of golf as a pair of sweatpants um but yeah I, I don't i don't to me i don't need to wear golf related items like i don't need a golf brand hat i wear random hats all the time i wear a patriot hat every other round of golf that i play in um so i'm not huge into that but i do get it like you don't want to wear sweatpants during a round of golf which uh yeah that's kind of goes in line with no jeans and no khaki pants uh shorts on the course so I'm going to have to uh, differentiate from you both, from you and Sean. Uh, if it's a cotton sweatpant, no. But if it's a fleece type of sweatpant, yes. You know what I'm talking about? Those, those. It's like, I don't even know how to explain it, but if they, to, to me, they're fleece. I, I, okay. Where I have, like the different I, texture on them? Right. I, they're like rain pants, but sweatpants. Okay. Yeah, I have a pair of Nike joggers that I rock always in the winter with a with a underlay underneath. But uh, absolutely not. If it's if it's a cotton type of sweatpant, like a gym sweatpant, I, no way. But I, there's no problem with those fleece sweatpants, like sort of like the rain gear, but for more for like Nike rain gear or something like that. Got you for sure. Yeah, I'm not a huge. Yeah, cotton sweatpants would be a no go for me. Yeah, yeah, I've seen it before. I mean, I've seen it all. I think the other day I saw someone in jeans. Yeah, yeah. Uh, this one comes from Big Mo Maxima. He says, "No, it's it's called Stay Warm by any means necessary." First of all, what a username. Yeah. Um, fantastic username. But yeah, that comes down to the layer discussion. Like, do you want to wear 12 layers and not being able to swing a golf club? Or do you, Jeremy's psychotic and wears one layer underneath like a hoodie. That's crazy. There's definitely like a sweet spot that you need to hit somewhere in there. Um, But I I agree with him. I stay warm by any cost. I'll layer up too. It doesn't matter. I'll play play crappy golf that day. I don't care. Let's jump over now to some tips that we can give the fans on how to dress for the um for those winter golf rounds let's start off with you know a simple scully nike foot joy and like t- any callaway everyone makes a scully you just got to find the right one you could find one on amazon pj superstore golf galaxy marshall's like like riley was saying before any uh scully from any brand is, is free reign and i love the nfl ones because they're super insulated because yes. they're the ones that the guys wear on the sidelines yes. they're like the triple layered ones i wear those all the time playing golf i'm not huge into it needs to be golf brands i'll wear anything right. uh so those nfl hoodies or not hoodies uh beanies during a round are my favorite you got that insulated yep. gray liner in, in, inside with the goopaline bowl on top and that's that's fantastic let's let's shoot over to the top now uh, this this can vary. You know, you got your foot joys with your winter outfits. You got your Nikes, maybe more on the expensive side. Uh, you got Adidas, obviously Callaway. Everyone makes the whole nine. But what's some what's a top that you think will work perfectly? Um, the quarter zips. The quarter zips are also all like very comfortable. I I like them a little bit on the thicker side. I think you might like the thinner one because you can a little bit more flexibility. I, again, I'm gonna stay warm. Um, so a little bit on the thicker side is good. I love putting a vest on top of pretty much anything. Yeah. Um, I don't know about vest on a hoodie. They make the hoodies that have like a built-in kind of vest look on them already. Nike has like the little bubble and whatever. Um, but yeah, anything quarter zip and then put a vest on top of it. I'm good to go. Good to go. Perfect. I'm right with you. Anything uh, quarter zip. Definitely. I like the sweaters too, like a pullover sweater, like a uh, something that Tiger would wear on the range on a Thursday yeah. morning or something. A little crew neck. Yeah, a little crew little neck. Crew neck. Yeah. Um, that's all again free reign to stay warm and maybe you throw maybe you throw in a, a, a full zip jacket and you're done you're ready to go minimal 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 layers but you're still be able to stay warm uh, let's kick down the bottom i think this is no there's no comparison and there's nothing no discussion here i think it's to stay warm you got to go foot joy uh winter soft pants yeah you need you need the winter soft pants um i i throw a little like i said a little like thin 
um, I don't know what you want to call it. I hate to call it a spandex pant, but underneath tights. something, a layer. Yeah, yeah, tights. Underneath, um, underneath the pants for sure. Again, staying warm. Um, but yeah, if you, if you wear shorts during a winter round, you're psychotic. Absolutely out of your mind. And last but not least, let's kick it off to the bottom now. The only shoe that you can wear out there, just find a pair of waterproof shoes. Anything waterproof. You're playing out there. You may be playing after a snowy day or maybe raining. You, it's going to be wet, guys. If you're playing in the winter, it's going to be wet. So I can, only thing I can recommend is play with waterproof shoes that no water gets in those shoes. Couldn't agree more. Bring an extra pair of socks, too, Absolutely. I've found. Extra pair of socks is huge, especially, like Jeremy said, it gets wet out there during the winter. Extra pair of socks will save your life out there on a cold day. Well, there you have it, folks. Episode four. Wow, four episodes in already. Can't believe it. Anyway, if you guys ever have any questions, make sure you guys hit us at the G Style Guys on Twitter or at Gif- Golf City Style on Instagram. Myself or Riley will be able to answer any questions you guys have. Style tips. Send us your pictures of what you're wearing that day. Anything, you, anything to be featured on the on the page. And uh, stay tuned for more, guys. Appreciate, it, guys.